Hey, hey, Guardians, Profane here. Thanks for checking out the video. It's not often that two top tier weapons drop in the same day, but I guess we're lucky. The Undercurrent Waveframe Grenade Launcher just released in Destiny 2, and this might be the best Waveframe Grenade Launcher that we've seen in Destiny since the Forbearance. And in many ways, you may find that this is a much better grenade launcher than the Forbearance is. Both are of arc affinities, and both have maxed out blast radius, along with some amazing weapon traits that provide stellar synergy. But unlike the Forbearance, you don't have to craft the Undercurrent, and you don't even have to jump into a raid, or have any of the DLCs. All you gotta do is complete the Lake of Shadows Nightfall, something that every Guardian can accomplish. And by doing so, you'll get random drops of the Undercurrent, which, as I said earlier, has some amazing weapon traits that you may end up liking more than the Forbearance. Because of its origin trait, the Forbearance provides health when reloading after final blows, but the Undercurrent provides health on every final blow, and when stunning champions, you could have health recovery instantly triggered with the use of stunning recovery. Just like the Forbearance, the Undercurrent can drop with bait and switch in the right column, giving this grenade launcher a 35% damage bonus, lasting 10 seconds. But this does require you to put in some effort, since you have to go through the rotation of all of your weapons to activate this damage bonus. Thankfully, the Undercurrent will also drop with Ambitious Assassin in the left column, which will make proccing bait and switch a lot easier and a lot more streamlined. There's other great options in the left column as well, like Demolitionist, Lead from Gold, and Stats for All, but Ambitious Assassin is really the perfect third column weapon trait. The one thing that Forbearance does have over top of the Undercurrent is Chain Reaction, and that's a big one when it comes to add clear potency. But the Undercurrent has something unique of its own. This grenade launcher can drop with Volt Shot in the right column. Once activated, this causes explosions to jolt enemies, applying continuous damage over 8 seconds, which can chain to nearby targets and stun Overload Champions. And when Volt Shot is paired up with Ambitious Assassin, the Undercurrent becomes just as lethal and dominating as the Forbearance is. And to the average and casual players of Destiny, it's a much easier grenade launcher to obtain. The Undercurrent does have adept options available, but those only drop out of Grandmaster level Nightfalls. Once you've obtained your first roll of the Undercurrent, you can use Nightfall Ciphers with Zavala to get additional randomized drops. If you do miss out on the chance of getting the Undercurrent this week, it will be back in rotation in weeks 10, 16, and 22. And with that said, I wish you all the best of luck in getting your own god roll of the undercurrent, Waveframe Grenade Launcher. Let me know your thoughts about this new grenade launcher, the Lake of Shadows Nightfall, and anything else Destiny. Let me know down in the comments below. Thank you as always for checking out the video. If you enjoyed and found it helpful, then be sure to hit that like button below along with the subscribe button if you're new. Both are greatly appreciated, and both really do help support the channel. If you're a new Light Guardian, just starting your journey, or a battle-hardened veteran, just looking for a new home, then be sure to check out the Discord link that's in the description below, and join one of the greatest communities in all of Destiny. And until next time, Guardians, this has been Profane, wishing you all some happy holidays, and some happy hunting.